Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Cheryl and on this channel we talk about all things fashion, lifestyle, and beauty. So if you are interested in any of those things, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss another video. we're going to talk about Amazon designer jewelry dupes. I have a couple of pieces here that I have picked up from Amazon over the past couple of years and I absolutely love them and I wanted to share them with you today. So we're going to just go ahead and jump right into the video and jump into these pieces that I have. And starting with earrings, we're going to start with earrings and I'm already wearing one pair of the earrings that I picked up from Amazon and they are these silver hoop earrings and they're very small and dainty and that's what I love about them. They look for a pair of earrings that you don't want to overpower your look you just something that's really cute and dainty but you do want to wear some earrings i believe these hoops are perfect for that and hoops are just iconic anyway in any size you can have them small you can have them medium or large size and they're just going to be a timeless piece of jewelry so i love these little silver hoop earrings and, then and i also picked them up in this rose gold color just so those are my really cute dainty hoop earrings let's move on to some more bolder and statement earrings. So the next pair of earrings that I want to share with you are these Valentino dupe earrings and I do have them in silver but they also come in gold but I think that these are a perfect alternative to the Valentino um, drop earrings. Now there are some differences obviously because they are not the designer pair of earrings but they are really cute i love the shape of them i love the length of them they're not too long they're not too big and they're not heavy they are very very lightweight earrings and i really really like wearing them when i want to kind of like jazz up an outfit if i'm going for more of a edgy look so i would love to put those on so i do have them in silver like i said and i am also considering getting them in gold i just feel like all of your jewelry pieces you need them both in silver and gold because sometimes my outfit calls for silver sometimes my outfit calls for gold but so moving on to the next pair of statement earrings and actually i received the first pair of these as a gift from one of my good girlfriends thank you girl i appreciate you she did pick me up these bottega dupe teardrop earrings and she picked them up in the color gold and i believe they are the medium size i do believe they come in a size smaller and a size larger but i opt to get the medium size just because I'm not too big on really big bulky jewelry, especially when it comes to earrings. So I thought the medium size would be a little safe for me and I absolutely love them. Like when she bought them and gave them to me, I was wearing them nonstop. Like I really didn't think I would like them. That's why I really wasn't, you know, pressed to get them at all. But she was like, oh, I think you look cute enough. I'm gonna get them. So she got them for me. And when I put them on, like I know I wore them at least a week straight because I love them that much. So I knew I wanted to go and pick them up in silver. So that's what I did. So I ended up picking them up also in silver so that I could have that option if I wanted to do my silver jewelry. And those are some really, really good earrings. I really love them. Would I spend the designer money to get the designer pair for either the Bottegas or the Valentinos? No, I wouldn't. I don't think they are worth that price point, but I do think that these are really great alternatives if you wanted to get that look for less. So those are the earrings. Let's move on to bracelets. So for bracelets, I do have several style of bracelets here. Moving on to the first style, I do have the Cartier Love Dupe bracelet, and I also have these in silver and gold. And what I love about these Cartier dupe bracelets from Amazon versus the original Cartier bracelets is that you are able to unfasten these and take these off each day. I am not the person that loves to sleep in jewelry. Like as soon as I reach home, I'm taking the earrings off, the necklaces, my wedding set is coming off, like everything is coming off. I cannot imagine having a bracelet that is locked onto my arm and I can't remove it. Like, now the next set of bracelets that I want to share with you are Hermes dupe bracelets. I do have 
have it in three colors. I have it in the black with gold hardware. I have it in the white with gold hardware. And then I also have it in this really pretty nude color with gold hardware. Those are my Hermes dupe bracelets. Moving on to the last set of bracelets that I have. These are a dupe for the David Yerman bracelets. And I have four of them. So I, so I have one with the gold cable bracelet. And it has like the little crystals at the ends of it and then i also have it in silver and then i have it with the mixed metals and i love that look because i do love to mix my metals and i love the look of silver and gold together so i think that looks really nice too. and then i also have the mixed metal chain link bracelet where you have your gold and silver as well and then i can wear that with either of those bracelets so and then the last piece of jewelry that i want to share with you are some brooches they actually came as a set of three and i mainly bought it for the number five because of course it reminded me of chanel number five and so i really wanted it for that brooch but it also came with like this little round pearl pin and then it also came with this little um white purse pin that i've never worn i have worn the pearl pin before i really do like it um but i mainly just wear the number five pin and i like to wear these pins or brooches i like to wear them on my blazers on my wool coats in the fall and winter on my denim jackets on dresses sweaters pretty much anything that i feel like needs a little something to it i also have a couple of watches that i picked up from amazon but i think i'm gonna hold off on those and show them in a separate video and just do like a watch collection video because i do have quite a bit of watches that i want to share with you so we'll do a separate video for my watch collection so that wraps up my designer dupe jewelry pieces that i picked up from amazon i will obviously link anything that i can find down in the description box but if you have any questions or comments leave those down below and before you leave don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye